She was a long, cool woman in a black dress, five nine, beautiful, tall. Just one look, I was a bad man. And all the way, just like that, you're six years old and you take a nap. Wake up and you're 25, you're high school. Say that's something to be proud of. That's a life you can hang your head on. That's a chin of pies, a tear rolls down. The lessons we learn are so simple and true yet profound. Shuck another man's corn and your barn burns down. <laughs> You know, I heard this guy say this at a club one night and I went, ooh, that'd be a great song. No, no, Jim Beam. Goes like this. For your car, I was like, man, I drive a Chevette with no floorboard, man. I don't need no garage. And he, I said, for free? And he's like, yeah, for free. I said, okay, I'll do it, man. And he said, okay, let me go home and ask my parents. I said, what the fuck? <laughs> so I went home and asked his parents, and I guess his parents thought it was crazy. So his parents he wanted to come back to the club and meet this guy singing. And they walked through the door, and his parents had to beat Johnny Cash and June Carter. Wow. Yeah. I, yeah, it was pretty cool. They had Waylon with them, and I peed a little bit, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I'm just kidding. She didn't beat me. He not with her hand, with a radiator hose. She beat, beat the shit out of me. And she always got that one arm, and if I ran, I just ran in circles around her, and she still get a lick on me. <laughs> this day, I won't even grab cereal. When I'll be by myself, I wanna grab, I was like, nah, that's all right. <laughs> I don't need cereal. That's okay. I don't need Coca-Cola. I know how that keeps me up all night. Soon I'll be like, I'd like to teach the world to sing the perfect harmony. I'd like to hold it in my arms and keep it company. It's the real thing. Coke is in the back of your mind. Coca Cola, what you're hoping to find. Oh, yeah, it's the real thing, and that's quite enough for me to die. Thank you.